In this video, I'm going to walk through the process of receiving, assessing, and returning student work by using email in Microsoft Word. As you can see in my email, I have received response paper number six from my student, Dan Werner. When I click on this attachment, it will open another window and you will see up in the upper right hand corner, I have an icon for downloading it. I will click this icon and the paper is downloaded to my downloads folder. I can click this button here to open that document and begin to give feedback to my student. To turn on the track changes option, you will click on the review tab and then click here to turn on those track changes. In this area, I also have the ability to add comments as I read through the document. With track changes on, you will see that I can type in any ideas that I want to share and the text is colorized to indicate to the student that I have ha added some corrections. I may also put my cursor in the area where I want to make a comment. When I click on the comments button, I choose new comment and now I can add more information here for the student. Once I'm done responding to the student's response paper, I will choose File and Save As. Then I will name this Comments for Werner. And I'll save it in my Downloads folder. Then I will return to my email and compose a new email to Dan Werner. Comments on your response paper. I'll click the paper clip at the bottom and attach the file that I have just saved. Now it is attached and I can send it. And that's all there is to it.